there then, Mikey. So Adam Ellerlutman is going to be at Everton now for the foreseeable future. Has the has what's gone on over the last couple of weeks? Has it soured your relationship with Adam Ellerlutman, or do no. you give him the benefit of the doubt? Yeah, I give him the benefit of the doubt. I mean, let's face it. What do we actually know that he's done? It's all conjecture. It's all hearsay. It's he said that. He said that. For all we know, he's been going to training and he's just been training. And he perhaps he was injured. And everyone says, oh, well, he didn't get on the mat on the pitch against Southampton. Well, we just went 2 1 down, so maybe it wasn't the right time for him to come on. You know, there's all these rational explanations about why he's not been playing and why this has been going on. And at the end of the day, is it his fault that a club wants to sign him? It just means that he's a good player and someone wants to sign him. So I don't know. I think I just think people wanted to believe that he was at fault for some reason. And once they got that in their head, they will look to find anything to justify it. Okay. They said, like, we should just go off what we know. So just to basically, just don't always believe what you hear. And just. But yeah. are you are, are you a little bit sceptic that he has been injured though, or not? Or do you? I, 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 I don't know one way or the other. So I'm not going to, you know, I'm not going to put the flag in the ground and say for sure because how do I? How, how is anyone supposed to know? That's the thing. Is if you want to say I think it's true, at least be honest and say that you think it's true. People are on the forum are talking like it's an absolute right. truth okay. that he's doing all these things, yeah. and there's absolutely no proof for it. And it's just you know he's he's a. He's a bloody kid. Yeah. It's, you know what I mean? It just feels like bullying after a certain point. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Adam Ola-Luckman. Staying, it looks like. The problem, child. My question is, has the has the previous couple of weeks soured your kind of view on Adam Ola-Luckman as an Evertonian? Yeah. yeah. That's what I it, 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 it did. And I said, this, I said this in our previous videos. I said, I wanted to shut. But... You know, he, they've obviously had a sp they've only spoken to the lad. You know, they, they know what they want from him. You know, he, know, he should now know what's expected of him. You're staying at Everton. You've got you've probably got until January to prove yourself. Yeah. And I thought that, that's all it's going to be down to. So if you're not, you haven't improved in January. You don't want to know. This is all in January, mate. We'll just get you to you then. Yeah, and yeah, then we'll have money to actually do something rather than having this coin at the end of August and not being able to spend it for four months. He has left himself in a, in a tough spot. No, like he, he has been pushing for this move last weekend. Do you, do you think that's the case, though? Paul? He, that's... he was putting stuff on Instagram last weekend about Red Bull scored a goal. Yeah, that's but he's a bit got, like well, he's there's got an affiliation there. Wait, yeah, yeah, on that, that. I mean, they're, they're some of his colleagues from last season. He yeah. may have just been yeah, that, that's a good point. Do you know? That's a good point. But I accept you. I mean, who knows? I don't know. Yeah, we're, we're all getting hearsay and innuendos and that. And obviously, there was rumours about the Valencia game where he was warming up and he was just sort of just showing along. I think he's told I like him. I think he's a good player. He's got a lot of potential. I, I, I feel bad that he, that uh, Brown, Brown Sauce Muncher sat with him on Everton. I don't use his name anymore. I just come up with something else. Gravy goes like anything else. <laughs> For but, a split second, I was like, what? Trying to make that one else. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but he, he sat with Luffman on Everton. I think uh, that, that's the big thing. But he, he's got to work hard now. He's got to work his way back into the fans' good books. And the only way he can do that is by coming on off the bench, making an impact. And I do think he, he will be an important player. Uh, um, he scored one Premier League goal. Obviously, he's not had the opportunities that he wants it to. Um, and uh, he's played in what four managers now, and four managers haven't been convinced. He's got a lot of proving to do. I think because he came with a big price tag, a big reputation. He scored against City. I don't know whether that was his debut, might have been his. Yeah, it might well have been his I think debut. It was. Yeah. It, was his um, debut. it comes with a big reputation. Everyone wanted him to kick on, but for whatever reason, he hasn't. Been. He played in the derby last year, created the goal, started off the move that created a goal for Sigerson in the, the away game. So he's got a lot to prove in my book. I hope he then now he knuckles down. There's a few rumours around that he's got a bad reputation. Don't know whether that's just rumour or not. But hopefully, he knuckles down. He's got at least six months. He's going to be playing for the club. So now he's got, especially with Charleston, he's out suspended for the next couple of weeks. He's not going to be back to the Arsenal game. He's got an opportunity now to get in that side and cement a place. And what better place to do it than here? Well, like, the guy's brilliant. Like, you can see he's got talent, but then you just think the attitude and that. It's like, you've seen a bit of sulking in the last, like, the few games, you know, when you come on and that. It's like, I'm not sure, but he's got talent. Like, you got to just get behind him now. That's where it's got to be. Like. Just give him your backing and see what he can do. We know he's got it in him, so just see what he can do. Thank you.